Hi ladies, welcome to my July empties. I'm going to see how long I can uh, go without putting on the glasses. Because uh, I know they, you know, they shine and it makes it hard to see. Okay. Um, first thing I used up this month, i um, going to do the uh, supplements first. This is the Thompson Omega 369 Essential Fatty Acids. Next, uh, another bottle, a different brand this month, Future Biotics Hair, Skin, and Nails. By the way, you remember the long, gorgeous nails I had last month? Well, two or three days after I did last month's video, two of them broke down to the quick. So they're a more reasonable length, as you can see. Uh, finished a bottle of Centrum Silver. I've already replaced it. In fact, I've already replaced the other two as well. I mean, I take those, you know, to stay healthy. Um, you see this every month from me, pretty much, but another bottle of uh, Dr. Bronner's Pure Castile Soap. As you know, this is my preference. This bottle is peppermint. I have already purchased again. Uh, I have another one, though, another body wash. This is Aqua di Parma Colonia Assoluta. And this is, um, I had the perfume with this, too, but used up the perfume quite some time before finishing up with the body wash and this was a body wash that did rinse off well and you know I felt squeaky clean and that's my preference as you know. Um, I used up two small samples of Missoni body cream. This had gone with a perfume I used up a couple months back and I was just kind of lagging behind on the creams. Used up a bag of cotton clouds this is the cotton um, I prefer to use on my face, but as most of you know that uh, use this particular brand, you've got to order it on Amazon unless you happen to know somebody that sells it. I don't. But that's the dupe for the Shiseido cotton pads. Okay, I also went through a bag of Studio 35 Premium Exfoliating Facial Cleansing Pads. I try to exfoliate a different way every day. I don't know if I'm right in this thought, but I feel like, I don't know, um, I'm doing myself some good by exfoliating with, you know, this pad had little nubbies on it. Uh, and then sometimes I'll use like a, a granular wash and then sometimes I'll use um, some other kind. Anyway. I didn't care for these. I don't, they hurt more than they exfoliated, I fear. So I won't be repurchasing those. Um, I used up another pack of the Say Yes to Clar uh, Carrots cleansing wipes. Um, I used up a pack of these last month. I found that I like them very much, so I repurchased and I purchased again. Uh, used up, this is, um, Let's see, I think this is Arm & Hammer, yes. Complete Care Plus Whitening, Baking Soda and Peroxide Toothpaste. This was kind of, for me, the toothpaste that wouldn't die. I'd use it for a couple months, not care for it, put it away, use something else, drag it out for another couple weeks, get sick of it, try something else. Anyway, it's finally gone. I won't repurchase. I don't feel like it really uh, whitened my teeth at all. And I think we're to the point where I'm going to require glasses for the rest of this. Um, let's see. I used up, this is La Prairie Age Management Stimulus Complex PM. This was a serum. This has been discontinued. I, I, I had a love-hate relationship with this. It seemed to, um, if you've ever watched some videos uh, of L is for living. She makes her own vitamin C serum and what she has said is that it brings up age spots to the surface. It gets rid of age spots but it brings up these other ones and then gets rid of them. And I feel like this was doing the same thing to me. And that's good because you want to get rid of your age spots but at the same time it was causing a lot of peeling around my nose and I hate that and other places on my face. So you know if you can't go out into public because your face is peeling 
that's bad. So it was a lot of hate. I'm glad it's gone. I can see why it was discontinued, if that's why. Uh, I used up one of these last month. This is Clinique Advanced Care Hand Repair SPF 6. As you can see, I sliced it down to get everything out of it. Um, I didn't care for it that much. I'm not going to repurchase. Uh, it was a gift with purchase, I think. I never purchased it in the first place. Okay, this is a Darfan cleansing water. Uh, this was a makeup remover, and it's for sensitive skin, and this was fine. I, I really am enjoying those wipes, so I probably won't purchase this. This was a small, I don't know if they say re revive or revive. It looks like maybe it's French, and they say revive. Uh, neck Renewal Cream SPF 15. Um, Crazy Miss Tammy says that she doesn't believe neck creams, throat creams do anything. Uh, I don't know if they do or not. I do know that this one didn't. So it was a nice moisturi moisturizer for my neck, and that's all. This was a sample in either an Ipsy box or um, something like that. This was Caldrea Aromatherapy Body Number no. 3 Coconut Fig Leaf Body Wash. Sample size. It did not rinse off. I hate that. It was relegated to hand wash. And it was fine as a hand wash. I would not purchase. I've been trying to use this up for quite some time. This is a old Chanel compact. I hit pan. I um, when I got to the pan, there was a little around the edges. I scraped out and mushed up and used, you know, like that. Uh, the color here was Dawn. And finally, um, I was prepared to come to you and say that. I have found one holy grail item finally. I will never have to buy another face wash as long as I live because I found perfection. These came out just a few months ago. The Olay Fresh Effects out of this swirled deep pore clean exfoliating scrub. And what it is, it smelled, let's see, this was the white grapefruit and green tea. There's another scent, I can't remember what that was. But this smelled really great. First thing in the morning, I mean, that's a nice smell on your face when you're waking up. It had a slight exfoliating um, aspect, some little grains in it, so that if you didn't have time to exfoliate that day, you were getting exfoliated anyway. I alternately used this with those cotton pads that I told you I didn't like. Sometimes I used it with the Clarisonic. It got my face squeaky clean, but it didn't dry it out. Great. Holy grail, right? No. This is one time, and I told you I wasn't going to tell you this every time, so here's the first time. The only reason I will not repurchase is because they test on animals. That's the only reason. Shame on you, Ole. Okay, that's it for this month. Short and sweet. Uh, I'm trying to get it up, actually, you know, in the first couple days of August, so... Uh, that's it for now. I'll see you next month or sooner if I actually get my act together and come up with some other video to do. Anyway, thanks for watching. Bye.